think it's important for writers uh, to meet people who read their books or who might potentially read their books. Um, it doesn't really work for me just sitting in a room all the time writing my poems. Um, I need to sort of strike a, a balance, uh, you know, with an audience or a readership. And I, I think it's I think it's good that you you put yourself in front of people and make yourself vulnerable and see how it works in front of a, a live audience, for better or, or worse. <laughs> led me to be a writer. Oh no, I've got four here. <laughs> four. <laughs> Laziness, can't be asked to get a proper job. <laughs> I've had proper jobs in the past, been a waitress, been a typist and a shop assistant. I was rubbish at all of those. Nosiness, desperate to know what's going on with other people. Number three, the belief that your viewpoint is more valid than other people's. <laughs> Writers have huge egos as a rule, in my experience. And what they're saying, in a way, is my version of this story is the best one. I'm talking about non-fiction here. Anyway, we're quite arrogant. And I suppose the fourth thing was I started observing my family's behaviour when I was actually quite young. I was listening to my father and stepmother having a row when I was about 11. I didn't really think about it, but I found if I wrote down what they were saying, it stopped being awful and it started being funny. And that principle runs through everything I do. I'd always harboured an ambition for a long, long time to sit down and write a novel. Um, and I tried probably for about ten years before I finally got round to doing it. Um, and I did it while I was on maternity leave with my first little boy, um, which was about three years ago. My first book was published in May this year. Well, Ted Hughes was the original inspiration, yeah. Uh, I don't think, if, I'd, if I hadn't read his poems at school, then I, I wouldn't be writing now. I mean, I was a completely uninterested and uninteresting student at that time and then it brought these little parcels of words into school and I read them and it just opened the whole universe up for me. It's, um you know, it's, it's nice to actually meet people face to face who are your either readers or potential readers. Um, so very much looking forward to it.